All right, what up, people? Welcome back to the channel. Hopping right back into another IRL baseball video. But first, I have to give a quick shout out to the sponsor of this video. That's right, guys. This video was sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Shadow Legends is a brand new RPG title that has an amazing storyline, awesome 3D graphics, giant boss fights, PvP battles, and hundreds of champions to collect and customize. Now, all that sounds great, but you want to know what's even more amazing? It's free. That's right, completely free. I've been playing this game a lot lately and I'm not kidding when I say this just graphically it looks amazing right here we are in a battle in game and just look how beautiful this looks I am not kidding when I tell you there are tons of champions in this game. My favorite one right now has got to be this Soulless Knight. He looks amazing. His stats are crazy good. I mean look at this guy. Who would want to mess with him? I know I want it. And you might be doubting me. You might say, Mighty Goat, this isn't as good as you're saying it is. Well, guess what? There have been thousands and thousands of ratings on this game on the App Store, and they are nearly perfect ratings. So pretty much everyone that has played this game agrees that it is awesome. There is a new rewards program for new players where you actually get a new daily login reward for the first 90 days in game. And guess what? I'm not done there. If you guys download it with the link in the description, you actually will receive 50,000 silver and a free epic champion as part of the new player program so once again thank you so much raid shadow legends for sponsoring this video but now let's get back into the action in the past we have done so many things with flex seal and today we are changing the game forever what we're doing is instead of flex sealing the outside of something we are actually going to be flex sealing the inside of something and that's something is a baseball. We've done this with a bat where we filled a bat with flex seal, but uh, I was thinking what could we, what else could we flex seal? And something no one's ever done is uh, cork a baseball, I don't think. You know, people usually fill their bats with uh, cork. They, uh, you know, they like bone rub their bats. They shave their bats to make them thinner, all this stuff. But no one ever talks about corking an actual baseball. So here is your ordinary baseball, right? It looks, uh, looks just normal, you know? No one would suspect anything, but right here, is the flex sealed baseball earlier today i drilled a hole all the way through i didn't go all the way through because uh i don't know if that would have worked right so i stopped about right here probably and then i filled it up all the way with flex seal and uh yeah now this baseball is corked first one in history like i've never read anything of people corking a baseball and we might have just done that today so we're gonna find out if you should cork baseballs and then somehow try to use them it'd be kind of a mess to uh use these in a game you know it's a lot easier just to cork that but we're gonna find out if it's even worth it and we're gonna find out if it's worth it by hitting the ball off of a tee and comparing it to the normal ball but we have a lot of different tests different variables that are gonna be used so round one we are going to be using a Marucci wood bat and a Marucci metal bat and then round two we are going to be using a Victus wood bat and then a Victus metal bat so we have a lot of different uh, scenarios here and if it is uh, true that flex sealing the inside of a baseball is better we're definitely gonna find out there's gonna be 100% certain if it's good or bad for it and let's go find out and yeah unfortunately we're not gonna be able to see how far the ball goes because they're having soccer practice out there so uh, yeah that kind of sucks the the sandlot is being overrun right now but whatever let's go see how fast we can hit these balls off the tee all right so round one we're gonna start off with the normal ball and I think we're gonna get, go uh, like two swings each so two with the normal ball with the wood bat then we're gonna go to the flex seal ball and see if it's faster let's go all right here we go Marucci round one normal baseball come on whoa 82. It was horrible. I mean, I haven't warmed up yet, so it makes sense. But let's go round two. All right, here's hit two. Come on, baby. Be better than 82. Boom. Oh, I just broke my ankle. 88. Okay, not bad. So 82 and then 88. Now let's go try the flex seal ball and see if it's better than 88. Let's go. All right, here she is. The flex seal corked ball. Got to be 88. Come on. Boom. 83. All right, well, technically faster than the first one. Now if we get 89, that's going to be weird. Oh, yeah. That was lasered. Absolutely lasered. Be in the 90s or be above 89. 86. God dang it. Well, round one goes to the normal baseballs. Let's go to the Marucci medal. All right, so round two, we're going the Marucci medal bat. Come on, I need the flex seal ball to win, okay? Bro. Oh. How was that, babe? How was that, babe? 88. God, dude, I, I'm not hitting the ball too hard today. It's probably because I'm old. 
I felt that one felt square. 90, okay, finally we're in the 90s. So 90 was the fastest. We're going to the uh, to the flex seal ball now. I kind of forgot what we were doing. <laughs> All right, here's the flex seal ball. Ripped it, come on. 87, god dang it, okay. Hit one is slower than hit one with the uh, normal baseball. Gotta get 91, come on. Come on, hit it good. Hit it freaking good. Decent, I think. Yeah, probably not. It was probably like 85. Didn't feel too good. 87. God dang it. Ah! All right, so we just got done with the Marucci bats and the baseball won. Uh, the flex seal ball did not compete, not even close. Nothing tied. It was just always slower than the normal bat. But now we're going to the Victus. Maybe we can see a big comeback here in round two. All right, we're going two swings, normal baseball with the Wood Victus. Come on, baby. Oh, yeah. Squaring it up, baby. I'm going 87. 90, there we go, baby, okay. I thought it would've been faster, I think. 90, okay, pretty consistent. Now we're going to the Flex Seal Ball. I bet you it's gonna be 89. 91, please. 85, what the F? One more, come on. I don't know if I can hit the ball harder than that. 82. It's getting worse, bro. It's getting freaking worse. All right, and now we are going to use the new Victus Metal Bat. Uh, the last video we used this in, I hit a ball the fastest I've ever hit, hit a ball off the tee. I think it was 94. So now this is gonna be the best one to decide if Flex Seal inside of a baseball is worth it. Probably not though, but let's go, baby. Going for 95, come on. All right, Victus Vandal versus normal baseball, come on. How was that, babe? Show me 100. 91, all right, we're getting better, baby. I'm telling you, this bat is freaking legit, dude. I think that was slower. 90, 90 and 91, all right. Here we go, the final test. If I could hit a ball over 91 with a flex seal ball right now, I don't know if that proves anything since it's already 0 for three, but we're gonna try it anyway. Come on, gotta be 91, please. 67. Really? All that hype for a 67? Obviously that's wrong. We're going again. Oh, I'm not feeling good about that one. I think I hit the top of it too much. 81. Oh my god. All right, we're going one more. I'm going to swing as hard as I can. Yeah, I can't hit a ball better than that. This says like 73. I'm going to freak out, dude. Come on. 89. God. Yeah, I don't know what else I gotta do to prove that uh, drilling a hole inside of a baseball and filling it with Flex Seal does not work. Like, uh, we did four bats, okay? And not once did the Flex Seal ball go faster than the normal baseball. So if you guys are trying to beat the system, trying to Flex Seal a ball, actually this could work for pitchers. Um, so pitchers, instead of using pie tar in your fingers, just get a fake ball, okay? Hide it in your pants somewhere, pull it out when you need to pitch, and then the hitter isn't gonna be able to hit the ball as far because clearly it makes the ball worse. So there you go, myth debunked. I don't know if this is a myth, but the first one ever to cork a baseball with Flex Seal proves it's not worth it. Let's go, baby. But that is gonna end this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you slap the like button. Also, right now, leave a comment below. Let me know what kind of uh, scientific e experiment you want me to do. Uh, like, we've done the Flex Seal inside of a ball. Uh, people are telling me to fill a ball with ramen, telling me to make a ball out of ramen. I got a lot of ideas, but let me know if you guys have anything kind of like this that we should do on the channel. We will definitely do that. And also, shout out to Claire. She got a little bit of Flex Seal all over her. <laughs> yeah, you ruined my shorts. Hey. I'm sorry, Flex Seal can't stop the power of me. Okay, bye.